This is Car Guys New England, your YouTube channel for anything automotive. This is Jay with Car Guys New England, and today I'm going to talk a little bit about the Pesco 280 aircraft pump behind me. So here is our Pesco 280 pump. Um, there are several different types of motors that came on these. There were the least Neville ones, which had just one post, and uh, they had the power box on the top. Um, then there was the Air Associates motor, which is actually a pretty ugly motor. I, I actually like these OG um, motors on the Pesco 280s with the two posts on them. Uh, here is the gear head for the Pesco 280. One is an inlet, which is on this side, and then you have your outlet. On the bottom side of the pump, which is underneath here, there's actually... Oh, a set screw and that is for your pressure relief um, that is meant to protect the gears in the event that uh, it's over pumped and the hydraulics can't pump anymore uh, that basically blows off the fluid so it goes back to the return um, so that's a safety feature built in uh, kind of not needed in the lowrider situation, so you do have to adjust that uh, in your lowrider. Uh, on the neck of the pump, uh, you'll see that this has different fittings on it, and one of the fittings down on the bottom here was actually meant, and actually you can see my finger is a little oily, um, that was actually meant so fluid basically could be bled off um, or it, basically any of the blow-by from the gears would be allowed to, to drain. A lot of guys put um, little catch cans on these because uh, obviously they're like 60, 70 year old pumps so they're going to leak unless you know you, you've rebuilt the seals, things like that. So uh, that's a neat little thing that you can do with the catch cans if, if you wish. Uh, a lot of guys just take these apart and they completely redo them. These are actually NOS. Uh, I got these. Uh, they were all sealed up and uh, they were actually brand new and I got a killer deal on them. This is a complete pump uh, for a special project that I am going to put them in. Um, the tanks are actually old oxygen tanks that have had fittings. Put on so you can use them as an oil reservoir uh, also a fitting on the bottom so that's basically feeding the oil into the gear and then so it's basically gravity fed and then goes out through a check valve then it's going to go through this hydro air dump so the fluid will go boom and then out uh, this is going to go out to a pesco equalizer which equalizes the pressure. So this would be just one front pump. And I have a second one of these set up the exact same way. So it would be two pumps, two equalizers. The equalizers split to the cylinders. Now the cylinders, uh, you're gonna need some large diameter cylinders for this and not just normal fat cylinders. Actually, Blackmagic Hydraulics sells the perfect cylinder for this. Uh, it's the OG Ted Wells cylinders. So that has enough volume in it to lift up the car uh, wh when you uh, activate the uh, PESCO 280. Uh, but overall, uh, this is almost done. Uh, there are a few things that I want to do to make this look obviously a lot nicer. Um, so fluid would return back from the equalizer into here. Uh, then a hard line it would go to slow down. Uh, and this is a 90 degree faucet style slowdown and then the oil would go back into the tank. So 
that's how this works. And uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you enjoyed this video about the PESCO 280, be sure to give the video a like. If you have questions or comments, be sure to comment down below. This is Jay with Car Guys New England. Until next time, take care.